Hi guys, uh, welcome back to how to make Friday Night Funkin' in Scratch. Today we're gonna be um adding the menu sections like story mode like where you can pick okay let's get on with the tutorial so um i realized that i forgot to add the um press enter to start text So you want to go to pixel, make it any color other than white or black, because that won't work. And then you got to type press enter to start. And then you can like uh, make this transparent now and make this white uh, a color so that you should have something like this. And you can move it to the center or somewhere else, depending on your liking. And then we gotta go to here. Uh, okay. So I think we just need this to go to um back layer and go forward one layer like that. So you can when click when flag click uh. Go to back layer, move forward one layers, and then forever change color effect by 25 or something. And then make sure there's a weight in there. I like got 0.1. Maybe a 10. Yeah, that seems pretty good. And then you can just go to menu, menu, button, press, song menu load. You wanna get yeah, when I receive song menu load. Set brightness effect to a hundred, and then. 0 0.1 seconds the brightness effect to zero then you can do a repeat three and then you should have something like this Actually, you can make this um, minus 100 so that's like invisible and stuff. And then, then yeah, uh, you wanna make a new sprite. And call it Song menu BG. And then you can like uh, get a yellowish orange, make a square, and then just uh, get like a brown or a black, depending on which one you would rather use. And then uh, just draw whatever you want. And when you're done drawing your drawing, you can um, code it like um, this. And click, hide, 
and then select click to hide, go to front layer. And then, um, you gotta do, uh, when I see first song menu load, uh, so wait, 0 0.1 seconds, show, go to front layer. But this this we change this to zero point three maybe. Yo, that's not good at all. Oh, and then make sure it goes back one layer too, sorry. Um because you want this to be able to be at the front. There, and then Okay, just change this to 0 0.6. That should be good. Yeah, that's good. And then, um, just duplicate it. Make this the first one that you made. Two layers. Make this one out oh, one layer, and then call this one song menu type, and then just call it a story, and then just um gonna draw a story or just use the text tool. And then, I'm just going to fill it with white. And then, you should be able to see story up here. And then you just want to, first you got to actually uh, duplicate it and, and invert the colors. Uh, if you have a gray or a black on it, and also a white, you might want to make the black um, gray. Or if you only have two colors, you might want to make one gray and one the right color. So then you should have this, and then this is the select. Uh, then this the selected one, right? So you want to call it. Selected and just call this story, I guess. And then, uh, when play clicked forever if touching mouse pointer, I mean, if else if touching mouse pointer, switch costume to selected else. Switch costume to story. And then you should have. Let me turn that off. And then you should have this. So that then you can, um,. Alright, okay, um, make a new variable, call it men, yeah, menu type. You want to go in, if touching mouse pointer, set menu type to story. But if else, just don't add anything now. And then you duplicate it and just rename the sto story part to free play. 
then uh, move it down here then make another drawing or something I ran out of room, so I'm just going to move mine to the side. And then... So you can rename this to free play. Two, so... Then do the same thing you did with uh, the story thing. Invert it. Oh, let's do back. Done. Then you should have. Something like this, and then you can just do one thing to change for free play. It's that easy. After that, you want to duplicate it again and then call it. And you don't have to do this part, but you can, if you do, call it options. Drag it below that, the free play. And then when you're done drawing your options, you can add copy, paste it, invert it. And we name the free play costume to options. So now everything should be looking fine. Let's just add some music. I don't have any music to use, so I'm just gonna... Oops. Yeah, I'm gonna use this one. You can make it quieter if you want. But you can make one click, one click, click, for every play sound, dubstep until done. Then you should have this. Thank you.